when you do your breath that shit move and stretch. That that's basically why moisturizing is so important because it's so trash. It's just a weak side. Why is that? Bro, your crown, even the crown stopped me, bro. Bro, I can't never find I just be guessing it. Alright, so what up though? Back with another video. And it is what do I do? Like what's my process? Like what do I do to brush my hair? Cause as you can see, like I said in the last video, I was gonna try to get get some waves. Uh that was back I said that in like November. It's December now. And so yeah, I've been going at it so what I'm about to do is show y'all, tell y'all what I do. If it's right, let me know. If it's wrong, let me know. If it's incomplete, let me know. I mean, because as of right now, this is the only thing I know that I'm doing. And then I'm going to talk about my beard, too. At the, uh, of, I got a couple updates about No Shave November, so yeah. All right, so cool, so we back. So I just got off the shower. I just washed my hair and everything. So, I'm about to show you first what I use when I get out the shower. So, when I get out the shower, I have to keep my hair, my, keep my hair and my scalp dry, like, moist. Because I have, like, because my scalp, I have eczema in my scalp. So, I have to keep it moisturized very well. So, first, when I get out the shower, Put this on, just some coconut oil. It's regular. Just put that on, rub that in with my hands, and get it all through my scalp and everything like that. I wipe it in, more on my hands, and then just go through. I'll go in the pattern. I'll go like the way I'm gonna brush my hair. It's the way that I put the oil in. After I do that, put this in. Uh, moisturizing hair lotion. Uh, I got this, obviously because it's olive oil and it got castor oil in it too, so I think castor oil helps. I heard it's supposed to help. If, I, if it don't, let me know. But, um, so I wrote that in my hands. Same thing as the oil. Same direction that I put. I'm going to brush my hair. After I do that, let that sit for a little minute. Brush my hair a little bit. And then put on the do rag or whatever I'm gonna put on. And I usually, since I usually do this at night, I obviously I do it while I sleep. Leave it on for while I sleep. But when I do it on for the day, it depends on what I'm about to do. If I'm going to class, I'll probably just leave it on until I get out of class. If I'm going to work, I'll probably leave it on for like a few hours while I'm at work. But I don't know. Last time I did for about an hour, so I'm probably do an hour again. So I'm about to put this stuff in my hair, do everything like I told you, and then I'm gonna tell you about my beard. All right, so cool. So I got my do rag on. I did what I told you. I did put the oil in this way. That one shut up. That way. That way. That way. And straight down the back like like that. Same thing to oil. Boop, 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 you know what I'm saying? And then make sure your hair is wet when you do it because it'll make, it'll, it'll help with when you, when. Make sure your hair is wet. It'll help when you apply it to your hair. It'll help it take to your hair. And when you, after you do it, when you brush, it'll help with brushing your hair. And then put the do rag on, then whoop the whoop, and then whatever your time limit is, there you go. So now I'm gonna tell y'all what I do for my beard. So Let's see if it focuses. So washed it. Now when I get out the shower, uh, first I had lotion. I had a lotion for it, but I ran out and I haven't been able to find it yet. So I've been using this specifically because it has an ingredient in it that I use. And I mean, then I heard it's supposed to be good. And then they got a whole bunch of other stuff that's like good for your skin. And obviously you should keep, like, this is still part of your face. So obviously you need to, like, lotion that up and everything to keep that good. And then after I do that, I put this in, which is basically, <coughs> it's 
basically a leave-in conditioner for your beard after you wash it. Yeah. I mean, it do pretty good. It uh, makes it feel kind of soft and bring a shine to it a little bit. So it's not too bad. So I'm about to... Uh, and then when I do, I comb, I pick it or comb it, whatever you want to call it. I pick this out as soon as I can. So then when I put it in, I can, like, get all the way to, like, all the way as much as I can to my, to my like, chin and everything. So I get really tight. So I'm about to do that and uh, put it in and let y'all know. And then, boop. That's how it go. All right, so first, you're going to see me pick it. Pick my beard. Pick it out with a pick. Pick it up with this pig. I had a little plastic one. I don't know where it is right now. I'm gonna probably end up getting another one if I can't find it. Cause I heard metal picks weren't really good for your beard or your hair at all. Try to get wood or plastic or something like that. Then secondly, you gonna see me put this in, lather it all in and everything like that. Get to basically the point of the lotion is to get to the skin get to my face underneath. That's the point of the lotion. And then also to help kind of like moisten up my hair before I put it up, put the, uh, put the next thing on it. Then afterwards, it'll be this. I'm gonna put that in, rub it all together. And then same thing we did with the lotion, except don't try to get it on your face. Just try to like, I don't know, like just try to like, Massage it just into the hair. Try to get it just into your beard. Try to get it like just into your beard. So then that way it like fully, you you get that shine. Like you know you know what I'm saying. But yeah, so you about to see that right quick. Alright, cool. So now we're done. And those are, that is, those are my few couple of steps that I've taken so far in order to get my waves. I'll make another video or to add to the end of this one what it looks like after an hour. And I'm gonna make another video of how I wash my beard and my hair like what I use and how I do it and everything like that but update for the No Shave November like I said I know it's December I only made one video for No Shave November I didn't have time it was finals this that and other school stuff so like yeah but haven't I have not gotten a I've gotten my hair cut but I have not gotten my beard. My beard has not been cut since the beginning. No, I'm gonna say, uh, it was like, like around Halloween. It was like the last time I went to the bar before, like these last two times. But um, I went, I told him I wanted to get cut low for this and for my beard, I didn't want him to even it. Instead of him evening it, ended up, just chopping it off and you know you know cutting my beard off and it's crazy because he asked me he was like he asked me about it he was like so what you want to do I was like just clean he was like, he was like you want me to clean up around the mouth I said yeah I said yeah no more than three seconds later well he ain't jump straight to the side what you look at he start cutting back here. I'm like, my guy, that's not what I said. First of all, you talking about cleaning up around here. I agree to that. I don't want hair in my food when I'm eating. You know what I'm saying? But I don't know. I don't know what we're going through here. So this is how how much I've grown 
like my beard since uh see if that's a little bit better. So you can kinda, so you can see what I'm working with like that. There you go, it's a little bit better. But yeah, that's what I uh, since I'm gonna just say Halloween. Was Halloween was when my beard got cut, I'm gonna just say that. So basically just how much I how much hair I've grown on my face since Halloween. Today is December fifteenth. Everybody know Halloween is the 31st. So between the 31st of October and December 15th, this is how far I've gotten with my beard. Kind of feel like if I had the stuff I was using last year, it might be going a little faster, but at the same time, being consistent also helps. I'm not going to say that I'm not being consistent, but I do can say I need to be more consistent to what I am. But, yep, that's what... Um, so that's my... My process on brushing on that's my after shower process for my beard and my hair, and then also the no shave November updates that I've been meaning to put out. So try to get something else out soon. Talk one of my mans. I'm gonna try to talk him into getting a YouTube uh, channel or just putting up a video. He he been doing he been doing the waves since like middle school so. Pretty sure he got some stuff that he can share if you want to share that me and you both know we need to know because I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just, I'm winging it, but like, I'm also like using like kind of like common sense, but or what I or what I know works for my hair. But um, so yes, yeah, so let me know what you think of the video. Hopefully, we'll be back really soon. You know, it's Christmas break now. School is over, so I should have more time. I got a couple of videos I want to put out, so watch out for them. Catch you later.